Uh, this is the bench just as you get it. It'll look just like this. Uh, it's pretty easy to set up. Let's see if I can do it. Um, I think I unscrew the legs first. I sort of keep the legs out when I'm setting it up. And then the top comes up, spin it around here, and there's a turnbuckle under the bench here. I have to unsnap it. It sits in a little holder here for transport. And uh, it's got a quick release pin. There's one on the bottom. You just line it up, put the pin back in it. Spin it around here, and it looks like it's a little high. So I'll run it down. Uh, this is your front rest. There's two spots here. You can put it for a long gun or a shorter gun. We'll try the short gun today. Uh, these come with the bench, the little sandbags here. Uh, here's the bucket. It's just a standard five gallon bucket. The lid comes with the bench. And, uh, and it's pivots. I like the bucket. Put my bullets, binoculars, a rangefinder, all that stuff's in my bucket. And there you're ready. Here's a rear bag. That comes with the bench too. Uh, these things are made here in Pennsylvania. They're really, really nice. The best ones I've found. And that sits on the back. And uh, here's in your rifle. Sits on the bench, just kind of massage that front bag a little bit like you would any sandbag. Uh, this front sandbag will hold up to a three inch forearm stock. And there it is, your gun, your gun sits on the bench just like this. You have left and right uh, motion here. And uh, you'll notice there's an adjustable leg here. You always want your adjustable leg downhill if you're shooting on uneven ground. Just put this downhill and you can unscrew it. It comes out like so, slides back in. And that'll get you level if you're on uneven ground. And then the, you're almost ready. Uh, I like to shoot like this. Sometimes I have a leg over this leg here. And sometimes I just move it around, just whatever's comfortable. Uh, you'll have, here's your windage. And your turnbuckle is going to be your elevation. Your gun's going to always be free recoil, just like this, which is your most accurate shooting. And I like to sit with my elbow on the elbow pad, and I'll have my hand on my gun, finger on my trigger, and my left hand is my elevation. And I just reach under the table. With my torso, I go left and right, and with my left hand, I can do the elevation. And I just look through my scope, and I find my target, and I'll move, and just, I mean, it's just that easy. Uh, on the front here, there's a little bit of friction that you can adjust this to give you a little friction here, wherever's comfortable. Uh, some people like it loose, you know, and some people like a little friction. I kind of like just a little friction there. And uh, what you'll notice when you're shooting, that the, when you move the bench left and right, there's no bounce back. When you stop, the bench stops. And uh, that took a, a lot of work to get that bearing to do that, to have friction and no spring back. Uh, it's really smooth, it's real stable, it has no movement whatsoever. Uh, you're gonna love it. I mean, everybody that shoots off of it just absolutely falls in love with the thing. And uh, weighs about 35 pounds uh, altogether. And uh, when I fold it up to put it away, uh, um, I got a piece of canvas, I wrap around it in a bungee cord and I throw it in the back of the truck. And that's pretty much it. I hope that, uh, you know, if you got any questions, just email me and we'll do, uh, I'll show you some more. Thank you.